Hi mom. Today we learned something very interesting in the class. All right Urvashi, what did you learn today? Mom, my teacher taught me counting up to 20. Okay, that's great. Urvashi and Aman, who is ready for a fun learning activity? Me. What are we going to do, mom? Yes, I'm excited too. Today we are going to revise counting. It's a useful skill and we can practice it in the park. Let's start by counting the trees. Aman, why don't you give it a try? Okay. 1 two trees, three trees, four trees, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. There are ten trees. Look, three birds in the sky. One flew away. Now there are two. And at the left, only one remains. The last bird disappeared. How many now? None. I can't see any birds. Exactly, we call that zero. We started with three and ended with zero birds. Zero means nothing or absence of quantity. Let's count these flowers in a special way. We will make groups of ten first. I see a bunch together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. I made a group of ten flowers. Great job, Urvashi. That's our first group of ten. Aman, can you find more flowers? Yes, I see one, two, three, four, five more flowers. Perfect. Now let's put it all together. We have one group of ten and five more. How many is that? Ten, eleven, twelve. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. We have fifteen flowers. Excellent. We made one group of ten, then built on that by adding five more. I see. Making ten first helps us count bigger numbers. That's right, Aman. This is how we make ten and build numbers. It makes counting larger groups much easier. Mom. We have learned about making ten. What comes after ten? Great question, Urvashi. After ten, we start counting with new number names. Let's learn them together. Can you teach us, Ma? I want to know what comes after ten too. Of course, after ten, we have eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and twenty. Before we leave the park, let's compare some numbers. Who can tell us which is smaller, five or eight? Oh, I know, five is smaller than eight. Excellent. Now, Urvashi, can you tell me which is bigger, twelve or seven? Twelve is bigger than seven, Mom. Great job. Let's try one more. What comes first when we count from smallest to biggest? Three. Nine or six? It's three, then six, then nine. Perfect. You are both doing so well. Remember, we can also count from biggest to smallest. Like twenty, nineteen, eighteen, seventeen. Exactly. You are both becoming number experts. Shall we get ice cream to celebrate? Yes, please.